Blacklist, the chairman of the British Property Federation, has prohibited both sexes from purchasing property in the UK. Meg SBS's British Property Federation chairman bans Sussexes from buying UK property. Hello, TR seekers, and welcome back to our channel where we reveal the shocking truth behind the glamorous world of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Ladies and gentlemen, keep your spirits up as we have some explosive news that is rocking the royal world. The British Property Federation is headed by none other than its chairman, Mark Allen, and director and SEC executive introducing the law. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been officially blacklisted from buying any new properties in the UK. That's right, there are no houses for traders, but before moving on to any other details, I do want to thank you so much for all your immense love and support, and in case you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, well, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button now and don't forget to press the bell icon, so let's get started now. The move has royal commentators buzzing with opinions some people think it could be a way for Harry to reconcile with his family, especially since he is sick at home because of life in England. But stay tuned as PR expert Kyrie Ron Elby has thrown a curveball, saying the potential property purchase could be seen as a deliberate move by Harry and Meghan to maintain their distance with the royal family. It's like a game of chess, and this move, my friends, is a strategic move. Albie emphasized the importance of finding a balance between personal freedom and maintaining connections to the institution that is such an important part of their lives, but it seems the balance is out of the hands of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. The divide between the royal family continues to widen, and this latest development looks like adding fuel to the fire. Another PR expert, Mikowski, has a different perspective, believing that this move or even just mere speculation about it will make a difference. Harry and Meghan, according to Yanovsky, are well aware that buying a house in England will help combat the rumors that exist, ensuring that they remain relevant in the eyes of the public. It's a bold strategy that's now getting them noticed. Speculation now involves not only property but also family dynamics. Will Harry use this geographical proximity to his strange father and brother to patch things up? Some say he could, especially since his children Archine and Liet are both far away from their extended family, but here's the kicker. A royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams has poured cold water on any hopes of Meghan returning to the UK. He believes that it's unlikely, and the same applies to Archie. Harry, on the other hand, there are a bit of limitations if a serious security concern and an ongoing lawsuit against the Home Office suggest that he's not ready to call Britain home even the King's request to stay at Windsor Castle. Was refused, it seems like the door to Harry and Meghan in the UK is closing, leaving them in a precarious situation. So what do you think about this news? Do share your thoughts in the comments section down below and let me know what you think. But until then, stay tuned for it. More shocking and scandalous stories on our YouTube channel. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to stay updated with the latest information from the royal world. Thank you so much for